वेलकम टू एस एस टीटोरियल टूडे आई एम हेयर उथ अ निव भिडियो दिस भिडियो इज गोईंग टू बी ऑन अ भेरि इम्पर्टेंट टपिक सो प्लिज डोन्ट स्कीप एंड कीप वाचिंग इन आवर वार्ल्ड देयर आर टोटाल सेभेन प्रेसार बेल्ट दे आर इक्टोरियल लो प्रेसार बेल्ट टू सब ट्रपिकल हाई प्रेसार बेल्ट टू सब पोलार लो प्रेसार बेल्ट एंड टू पोलार हाई प्रेसार बेल्ट इन दिस भिडियो उल ब्रेफलि डिसकस अबाउट इक्टोरियल लो प्रेसार बेल्ट and two subtropical high pressure belts please watch this video until the end so let's begin at first we will know about equatorial low pressure belt equatorial low pressure belt generally lies between 5 degree north to 5 degree south latitude as you can see in the diagram in this region solar insulation is highest because of the sun shines here perpendicularly or vertically so air remains warm throughout the year If you see on the world map then you will sure find that in this region water is more than land warm air has a higher water vapor holding capacity and as warm air has less density it becomes lighter this warm and lighter air expands and rises and forms a low pressure belt which is known as equatorial low pressure belt air pressure drops to 996 millibar at some places Due to lower air pressure in equatorial region cold air comes from two subtropical region to the equatorial low pressure belt and meets together in equatorial region near to the earth surface the region where air meets together is known as intertropical convergence zone or doldrums as there is no horizontal movement of air as air remains calm but vertical movement can be seen there The wind which comes from subtropical region to equatorial low pressure belt is known as trade wind. After convergence of trade wind in the equatorial region, air gets warm and rises. And due to this, heavy convectional rainfall occurs. For that, equatorial or tropical rainforest are located here. In this region, centrifugal force remains higher due to rotation of the earth. Air which warms up in equatorial region near to the earth surface and rises that air cools after reaching 10 to 12 km height and tries to descend straight but due to centrifugal force and due to vertical air currents air cannot descend straight as a result air deflected in both the hemisphere and descends at 30 degree to 35 degree latitude in both the hemisphere and get peeled up this results high pressure calm condition with feeble and variable winds are found here these pressure belts are called subtropical high pressure belts this region is also known as horse latitude because in the past vessels with cargo of horse passing through this region found difficulty in sailing under this calm condition because in this region air descends and there are no horizontal movement they used to throw the horse in the sea in order to make the vessels lighter for that these pressure belts or this latitude are known as horse latitude the pressure belt shifts 5 degree north of the equator when sun is overhead the tropic of cancer and this pressure belt shifted 5 degree south of the equator when the sun is overhead the tropic of capricorn the equatorial pressure belt originates as a result of thermal effect because sun shines perpendicularly in the equatorial region that's all for today hope you like this video thanks for watching if you like this video then please press the like button and share with your friends to get our new video please subscribe my channel thanks for watching